The reality is that we think that the economy will remain slow for the rest of this year and uh, for 2013. The main reason why this is the case is that the U.S. consumer will need to uh, continue to save in order to rebuild the wealth that they have lost with the crisis, in particular because of the sharp fall of house prices. And uh, consumers from abroad won't be of uh, much help either because growth prospects abroad uh, don't look particularly exciting as well. Well, the loss of jobs has been uh, one of the most striking features of this recession. About seven and a half million jobs have been lost since the start of the recession, and only a fraction of them, about three million, have been recovered. Uh, and of course, many more jobs will need to be uh, added just to keep up with the population growth. Uh, when this is going to happen, uh, we believe it's not going to happen very soon because the U.S. economy is going to continue recovering only slowly from the recession. But we're confident that from 2013 on, with the economy accelerating, there's going to be more jobs created in the U.S. There are a couple of critical deadlines that are approaching that will test Congress' ability to find a common ground. Uh, one is Congress will need to authorize uh, the government to increase the amount of debt that it can raise uh, early in 2013. And early in 2013, a series of tax breaks are going to expire and some across the board uh, spending cuts are going to kick in, the so-called fiscal cliff. Uh, if Congress uh, uh, is not going to act to prevent that from happening, uh, the recovery is going to be threatened at the time where it needs uh, a lot of support still.